Hey guys, it's Arika Misha in the kitchen, getting ready to bake it up. And today we have the Betty Le Crocker peanut butter cookie mix. Betty Crocker peanut butter cookie mix. And I got this from Dollar Tree, y'all. Dollar 25 tree. I got three packs. Says ready in three easy steps. We'll see about that. Make 12 two inch cookies. I'm gonna make them the size I wanna make them. Anyway, Betty. All right, let's see what's going on in the back. Y'all know I gotta be reading the business in the back. Better not be no foolishness, Betty Crocker. Better not be. So, most cookies need oil, butter, water. Anyway. All right, so let's see what we got. Okay, Betty Crocker, you will need two tablespoons of vegetable oil and one tablespoon of water. <laughs> we can do that. Let me show y'all. Quick and easy. Okay, heat the oven to 375. Oh, Lord, let me go preheat the oven. Wait, wait, wait. Heat the oven to 375 or 350 for non-stick cookie sheets. Shucks, I gotta go preheat this oven, y'all. Hold on. All right, child. Forgot to preheat the oven. Oh, well. My um, oven heats up fast. All right, for non-stick cookie sheets. I forgot my cookie sheets. I gotta do better, y'all. That's the word of the day. God been dealing with me on that. Do better, girl. I, I know. I gotta do better. Y'all yeah, know. You know what area you need to be doing better in. I do, too, so... All right, let's get back to these cookies. Cookie mix, all right, uh, stir cookie mix, oil and water, medium bowl with dough until dough form, forms. Shape dough with 12 balls, about one each, one inch each, two inches apart on ungreased cookie sheet. Flatten, crisscross pattern with the fork. Y'all, yeah, we know how to do that. Okay, anyway, child, I'm gonna dump this all in, put in my um, vegetable oil I got over there in my water, mix it up, and shucks. All right. I gotta get my cookie sheets out. Hold on. Ain't even got the cookie sheets out. What kind of mess? <coughs> Where, where's my cookie sheets? Oh Lord Jesus. Y'all hold on. Y'all hold on. Just told y'all I gotta get my stuff together. Alright, so we got our cookie sheets. All four of my cookie sheets. These are non-stick cookie sheets. I got these from the Dollar 25 tree, y'all. Good enough. These are good enough. So, all right, y'all. Let's get this mixed. Let's get this done. It's easy. Okay, they even make it easy for you to open. Let me smell it. Ooh, that's straight up peanut butter. Peanut butter jelly. No, no, we ain't gonna say that. Okay, all right. Expiration date, May 20, 2023. Okay. All right, my dollar 25 tree. Y'all make sure y'all checking y'all expiration dates at the dollar 25 tree now. Y'all know I love the dollar 25 tree, but sometimes they stuff be a little expired. So make sure y'all watch y'all dates. Watch your dates. You gotta watch. All right, so let me move over here so y'all can see better. Okay, child, move out the way. Oh, Lord. All right, I'm doing three packs. Y'all already know these little packs don't have much mix in it. So, that's why I grabbed three. I wanted to grab four, but they only had three, so. All right, let's get our cookies made. Y'all know I will bake something up in a minute. But I needed to be quick. I needed to be quick, quick. Okay, we got three bags in there. Okay. So since we got three bags, y'all know what that means. We're gonna have to triple all the ingredients. Two tablespoons of vegetable oil. I'm gonna have to do two, four, six tablespoons. I got my tablespoon, my little tablespoon measure right here. We're gonna need six, cause that's two per bag. All right, so let's get the, oh, that's one, two, Three, four, five, okay, six. That's our six tablespoons of vegetable oil. And I keeps the vegetable oil. Y'all know I keeps the vegetable oil. That's what I fry my food in. All right, two tablespoons. So we got six in there, one tablespoon of water. Okay, so we need three tablespoons of water. Oh, there's one, 
two, three. That's what I be talking about. Y'all be playing around. Y'all can have some peanut butter cookies in minutes. Come on now. Y'all can bake them churn some cookies in minutes. So, don't be talking about turning out time and baking them churn no cookies. Bake the churn some cookies. Chuck, bake yourself some cookies. I'll be baking and cooking myself stuff. All right, y'all. We got everything in there. Let's move this stuff out the way. Let's throw this away. Okay, what we got to do? Bake 8 to 10 minutes until edges light and golden brown. Cool two minutes before removing. Okay. 8 to 10 minutes. Let me throw this stuff away. All right, we know what we're doing. We know what we're doing over here. We know what we're doing. So, all right, let's get this mixed. Now, y'all know peanut butter mix ain't going to be wet, like a chocolate chip or something, or a brownie mix. Peanut butter mix is usually, you know, a little thick, like real thick and kind of dry. So, that's peanut butter. I'm not going to add nothing to these people recipe. That's one thing I learned, y'all. I used to add stuff to people recipe and it kind of it messes it up throws it off because you know the measurements are the measurements for a reason so leave the people stuff alone child that's what I learned but see the old me would have added sugar and peanut butter to this but see that that would throw it all off that would throw all the measurements off so I don't mess with stuff no more if I want to add peanut butter and more sugar, I just do homemade, you know? Do my own homemade stuff. Let's see, let me move this fork out the way. I'm going to use my little $1.25 handy dandy. My little spatula. Y'all know I love my little spatula. All right. Let's get this all mixed up because that fork was not doing it, boo. Not doing it. Ugh. And this peanut butter mix, y'all, I be thick now. Peanut butter mix ain't like, peanut butter cookies ain't like, um, like I said, chocolate chip cookies and brownies. It's not a wet mix. It's a dry mix. You definitely want to make sure you get it all mixed up real good. Your oil and your water that you added. Make sure you're scraping your bottom. Getting your mix all mixed up real good. Ooh. Ooh, chai. See, I got a couple little dry balls in here, so let me. Make sure I get this mixed up. Let me see. I need to mix this with my hand, y'all. This peanut butter uh, mix ain't doing it. It's, it's not mixing right, so I got to help it. I got to help it because we still got some little dry balls in here. We got to get this mixed up right. Y'all ain't going to have us. Ain't going to have us eating all crazy. Peanut butter mix not even mixed right. Let me help it out, child. Thank God it's peanut butter mix. I could just mix it up just like that. Okay, this peanut butter smell good. Now, if you don't like peanut butter, these ain't the cookies for you, but we like peanut butter. How y'all doing out there? I hope everybody's doing all right. I pray for everybody every day. I say, Lord, pray for the I pray for the whole world. I pray for everybody, child. We got too much going on. Everybody need prayer. Everybody need prayer, honey. And if you're going through, don't think you're the only one going through. Please don't think that. Please don't think that you're the only one going through. Because I know from experience, uh -huh, I feel like, God, am I the only one going through? Am I the only one going through this? Sometimes I feel like, God, I'm the only one going through. And God say, you ain't the only one going through. Come on now. Don't convince yourself of that. You ain't the only one going through. Everybody going through. Just because just cause somebody got a smile on their face don't mean they ain't going through nothing. They just hide it good. <laughs> I'll just keep it real. They just hide it good. Don't go around dragging with your face hanging because you're going through. Shucks. You ain't the only one going through. Shucks. You ain't special. Shucks. Everybody going through. How about that? <laughs> Sometimes, y'all, we just got to get it. We just got to get it. Tough. Tough love. That's just how it is. That's how God is. He give you that nice, gentle love, and sometimes he show you that tough love. That's just how it is. Shucks. That's just how it is. I said, thank you, God. Long as you love me, Lord. Long as you love me. So, ooh. Peanut butter cookies looking good, y'all. See, peanut butter mix is thin, different than the regular cookies. I ain't told y'all that. So, all right. So, I think we got this mixed up real good. Let me make sure. Make sure I got it mixed up real good. Okay. 
I do. I think I got it mixed up real good. I'm just checking it. Uh-uh, peanut butter mix. All my stuff I pay for. All right, y'all. So, let's get these into little balls. Y'all know what I'm going to do? Um, I was going to get my ice cream scooper that I always use. Yeah, I'm going to do that because I want to make sure these are all the same size. Hold on, y'all. My little one-inch. My little one-inch cookie thing. Let me dry this off. Me, no problem. Smell like straight up peanut butter in here. All right, y'all. So I'm just gonna use. Y'all know I love using my little, my little uh ice cream scooper thing here. Little one inch. I think this is a one inch. I say that every time, y'all. I don't know. It look like one inch to me. So I'm just gonna feel it like that, you know, and make sure they. That way, I know they all gonna be the same size. So do them into little balls like that. Okay, let me see, make sure y'all can see. All right, I'm gonna put the little, little balls down over there. I'm not gonna show y'all every last one of these. I'm just gonna show y'all me doing one. And then, I'm gonna do them all off camera. I'm just showing y'all how to do it. Shucks, I'm just trying to show y'all how to do it. Cause I got all these little peanut butter balls to make. So, all right, so you make it a little ball. <coughs> Excuse me, y'all. Make the little ball, a little peanut butter ball like that. And y'all see I use my little ice cream scooper. And then you take your fork. You take the left fork. And you smash down one way like that. With your fork. See? See how I did that? Let me show y'all. Let me bring it in. See how I did that? One way with the fork. Come on, lighting. It's this aluminum pan, child, that be reflecting the light. Look. Child, anyway. Okay. So let me turn around this way. So y'all see how I made the little marks the one way. And then I'm gonna take my fork and go the opposite way. Like that. Ooh, y'all, that's so cute. Ooh, that's so cute. That's so cute, y'all. That's how you do it. See, it's still aluminum that be tripping with the light. But ooh, there it is. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Y'all can see. Ooh, y'all, that's cute. That's cute. That's cute. All right. So, I'm going to go ahead and do all these, y'all. I'm going to go ahead and do them all, get them all panned up, and put them in the oven, like they said, 8 to 10 minutes, y'all, until they look golden brown across the, uh, around the edges. So, y'all seen me do it. Y'all seen me do it. So, let me get these in the oven. I'll be back to show y'all that grand finale. Cookies in 8 to 10 minutes. Y'all better go get these cookies some kids. These cookies some kids. Go get these kids some cookies. All right, I'll be back. Okay, guys, this is the grand finale. 8 to 10 minutes. Well, it took mine 10 minutes. Well, anyway, Betty, 8 to 10 minutes, peanut butter cookies, all done. And they look amazing. Y'all see, I ain't taste none yet, but I'm sure they taste good. Betty usually tastes all right, child. Ooh, don't they look so good? Let me bring y'all out. Just cookies everywhere. Peanut butter cookies everywhere. Y'all see them. The whole house smell like peanut butter. Whole house. Take y'all in so y'all can see them peanut butter cookies. Betty Crocker peanut butter cookies. Well, all right. Y'all seen me do it. Y'all seen me do it. Y'all seen my hands in the video. Y'all seen them. Y'all, okay. Y'all heard my voice. Y'all know it was me that cooked these cookies. Y'all know it was me. Nobody else. So, yeah, I have to tell y'all that every video so y'all know it's me. This is Arika Misha. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Follow me on all my social media at Arika Misha. And don't forget, guys, that knowledge is power. Thanks, guys. Bye.